Queen Mother has died peacefully in her sleep at a quarter past three this afternoon at the Royal Lodge, Windsor, at the age of 101. The Queen was by her bedside. The Queen Mother's coffin is expected to be taken to the Royal Chapel of All Saints in Windsor Great Park tomorrow morning. The Prince of Wales, Prince William and Prince Harry were said to be devastated after being informed of the news on their skiing holiday. There'll be a special programme about the Queen Mother next on BBC One. Live coverage continues on BBC News 24 and I'll be back at nine o'clock with the main news. This is BBC One. In light of today's news, our normal schedule has changed. The lineup for the next few hours now looks like this. There'll be another special news programme at 9 o'clock, followed by Man and Boy, half an hour later than planned, at 9.30. Also because of today's events, we won't be showing the National Lottery draw live, but it will still go ahead, and we'll bring you the details of the numbers drawn just before the news at 9 o'clock. You might like to know that Casualty will now be shown on BBC Two at 10 past 8. So now on BBC One, by way of tribute, we remember the long and celebrated life of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth, the Queen Mother. In 1908, Leonora Lang dedicated her book of princes and princesses to eight-year-old Elizabeth Bowes Lyon. The last story ends amidst the welcoming shouts of the English people, Elizabeth was proclaimed queen. Thirty years later, that's exactly what happened. Elizabeth Bowes Lyon was born on August the 4th, 1900. 